The sun has begun to shine at long last once again in the city of Halifax, Nova Scotia, one of the most beautiful and resilient provinces in the country, being asked to show that resiliency once again after a storm that broke records that stood for almost a half century dropped 10 inches of rain in 24 hours and sent floods across the province. You wouldn't believe it looking at these images coming off of that 1-0 defeated Cavalry last Saturday. Patrice Geyser makes two changes to his 11, bringing in the captain, Andre Rampersat, to line up beside Lorenzo Caligari. Teo Colum will take over at the number nine. Mo Omar dropped to the bench for Atletico Ottawa. It was a huge victory at TD Play Stadium last Sunday. 3-1 over Vancouver. And from that team, Carlos Gonzalez makes a quartet of changes. Two very good looking benches today as well for both of these sides, it should be said. Zachary Fernandez back from injury, Joao Morelli, who was featured in all the matches since his return was announced. Daniel Henry, of course, could make his debut. Tiago Coimbra, Mo Omar, and Tomas Giraldo. Here's Malcolm Shaw. Very on one slide and could not come up with the ball. An incredible back post run from the Swiss striker. 23 minutes through the match and the possession 74% for the Halifax Wanderers, which should surprise nobody. That's a great ball. Oh! First time the post! Slip to Daniels as the ball returned by Colum. Full slide from Carl Lamette. Buys out of a bit more time. And in the box, right into the goal area. And it's sent over the bar by Ferrazzo. Danger continues to be created from wide positions, and it's Teo Colum showing off his distribution this time, Jimmy. How it's not 2 0. The patience from Aiden Daniels sends Antonoro sliding through the slip turf. Now Nemec being spun around by Shaw, starting to hunt in a pack at Letico Ottawa. It's the best they've played all half, and they save it for the final seconds. Antonoro for Bassett, onto his left. Jan Filion dives through the air. Doesn't end up needing a piece as Bassett just misses. A wake-up call for the Halifax Wanderers. Uh, they need to play through the final minutes, including stoppage time. Daniel sprints at Zapater and is unable to get by the big Spanish midfielder, Del Campo. Great pass to Shaw. He fires goal and gets to the time. Morelli looking for his first goal of the season. An insurance marker, a huge one. He was the target of that free kick, and it sits for Callum Watson. Remet. It's a slow burn, but it feels like Ali Bassett has finally arrived in this game. Rampersad bites on the fake from Zapater. No! Oh! Just about leaves the property as he couldn't keep it down. Caligari. Poor touch from Zach Verhoeven. Morelli makes him pay. Joao Morelli outside of the stick for Fernandez. Here's Ferrazzo! Unable to find target! So close to a second goal, Jimmy. A spell was desperate to get back. Send to the left side, Johnny Dos Santos with the ball at his feet. Into the box it goes, and headed down by Sam Sander. Stunned into the near post by Jan Filion. SC to Espejo, a touch from Lockery, loose in the box, Carl Rimets. 
was never able to get set, and because of it, the ball stays off of target. Last ditch attempt for Atletico Ottawa to find points. Well, that doesn't sum it up. Five straight wins for Patrice Geyser and his Halifax Wanderers in Nova Scotia. This province has gone through hell and back once again this week, but their professional football side is gonna send several thousand home with big smiles plastered across their faces as the Halifax Wanderers get three massive points.